Left. There's four games going on we right got, now. We got we got Bears Rams <laughs> and oh, no, the Raiders later. and the Raiders Ravens. Uh, and yeah, yeah that, if any, that's gonna be any of you Packers fans care, go to watch Tom Grassi because he's live streaming right now. I mean, the, <laughs> the the Packers are laying a goose egg. They've only scored three points against the darn. They're down Saints. like seventeen three. Yeah, no offense to you, uh, Saints fans, but your defense is darn good. Just like the, that's why the Steelers beat the on. Uh, yeah. Bear, Bills. Bills. Just so you know, Bills. I just want to tell you this straight up. This year, it's about if you have a good defense, you're going to be good. Either way. Yeah. What happened to Cam Newton? He went from an MVP to getting released. He might not even he might not even be picked up by a team now. Yeah, I mean, like, in 2015, he was the best, MVP. Qu yeah, best quarterback. MVP. Almost won a Super Bowl, but he decided Arguably to Arguably the best the quarterback <laughs> in the NFL in 2015. Of course, he threw 35 touchdowns and only 10 interceptions with Almost 4,000 yards passing. He ran for. Dude. He ran for all, over um, 280 yards. Yeah, he didn't, have much, he didn't have much in 2019. I mean, he got injured. Yeah. Um, they sucked without him. Uh, Dude, he bought. 2015, went to the Super Bowl. 2016, made the play. No, they. Went had a six losing, and 10. Losing record. Wait. He went 6-8 six six, in 2018, six, 19 six, touchdowns, 14 interceptions. Yeah, and 11-5. and five, They lost in the wild card to the Saints, and yeah. He, um, he wasn't the same. 22-16, to 16 inter, 20, 2 touchdowns, dude. 16 interceptions, 20-17. Uh, he wasn't bad. He just did, he looked like, he just didn't look right. So, 2018, he, I mean, they, they were good at once. They were like, what, 6-2? and two? And they started taking L's. They went 7-9. and nine. Not good at all. Um, well, to end it, <laughs> that's not good. Um, basically what happened, he went from, okay, if you weren't paying attention, like, last season, if you didn't pay attention a single bit, you would not, you wouldn't even have known that, hey, he was a patriot, you wouldn't even have known one thing, and if you were paying attention before that, you would have known he was going on, he, he was doing pretty good, but, um, he got to the Patriots, I mean, if you didn't fall at all last year, way to the previous season, you, I mean, you wouldn't have known last year that he did, he didn't do very good, and, if you were to be some, and if you didn't pay attention last season, yeah, I mean, now you would be, you would be kind of shocked. He's really, he got released by New England a while ago, and I don't know what, what's gonna happen to him. Like, is he gonna get picked up by a team? Is a team like gonna sign him or no? I don't know. He might, he might be done, but I don't know. I mean, what do you think? So, uh, I gotta go back to 2018 because this is when I think he absolutely sucked. I'll tell you that just straight up. Six and eight, uh, three thousand three hundred ninety-five yards, twenty-four touchdowns, thirteen interceptions. Six through the six and two record before he got yeah. hurt on the Thursday night game against the Steelers yeah, in absolutely. week not in week ten. I uh, honestly gotta say he looked like he was gonna win comeback player. He was honestly looked like he he might have a chance at being a Pro Bowler, maybe even an All Pro. He looked very very good. He looked like twenty fifteen Cam Newton exactly. He popped and dislocated his shoulder. He mm -hmm. came back two weeks later. They were six and five, and he was playing yeah. the Falcons. He got hurt again. Yeah, he just. And when he got hurt this time, he didn't come back. Well, he did come back. Yeah, twenty nineteen. Well, he kept. He got hurt, and then he he kept playing. And then, unfortunately, the last week of the season, he didn't play. And then so he comes back 2019. I'm ready. A foot injury and a couple other really stupid injuries. Second half. Kept him out for the rest of the season. Yeah. 0 2, 0 touchdowns, 1 interception. Yeah. yeah, he did throw for some yards, though. I got to admit, he did throw for some yards. 2019, he got released by the Panthers. Yeah, I'm well, we'll talking about 2019. I mean, yeah, 5 and 3. And then the Panthers went 0 and 8 to end the season. Not good at all. All right, so he got released. Now, 2020. Let's break this down. 2020 was a year where Cam absolutely laid a goose egg. It wasn't just on him, of course. It was everything else. But if I have to admit, Cam couldn't throw the ball. Yeah, true. He could yeah. not throw the ball. He could run the football. He ran for 12 touchdowns. Yeah. He could not throw the football. There are quarter. If you're a quarterback in the NFL, you can't throw the ball, you're going to get caught. <laughs> it's simple. If you can't throw the football, you're not going to be a good court, successful quarterback. Yeah, he did have a 65-point completion percentage, the highest of his career. One of the highs, actually. But he 
he just didn't he just didn't get it done. Mm-hmm. Eight touchdowns, ten receptions. He didn't throw nearly any passes over forty five yards yeah, more definitely. than a couple times. Dude, with him running, he 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 fumbled in the game against Buffalo. Yeah, he wasn't good. He had actually not a terrible season on the ground. Like he averaged over six yards per carry. Yeah. Pretty good, but he was went too much. He didn't actually, get it done. Yeah, and he's released. And no team wants him, literally. I can show you guys proof. No team wants him. I can never show you guys proof. But to be a little more, well, simple, he might have a chance to get signed. Ryan Fitzpatrick of the Washington football team, he got hurt again. He got yeah. hurt pretty bad. There's a good chance he will be out for a significant Re- amount of time. Yeah, my, my watch. imagine if he reunites with Rivera, I'd imagine. And if I was Ron Rivera right now, I'd be stupid not to sign Cam Newton. Not because they actually need him, but because Taylor Heineke will not make you get to get to the playoffs. They have a championship caliber defense, one of the best in the NFL. It looked yeah, like it. Great defense. Very, very, very good defense. Now I'm about to show you guys this thing that from way, from a little girl. Look, look at this. Oh, look, no teams want Cam. Literally, no teams want Cam Newton. That's going to change by tomorrow. Ron Rivera is going to have to sign Watch. Cam. Yeah. Fitzpatrick Watch it. Who are they going to use? He- I mean, Cam. They could use Heineke. They could use um, Cam Montez. might be starting by yeah. Thursday. Well, okay. I know that could sound crazy, but if they sign him tomorrow, there could be a small chance he might start. But if I, I have to be honest, it wouldn't surprise me by week three if Cam was the starting quarterback for the Washington football team. You good? I mean, that's what you want to say about him? Well, yeah. yeah I mean, well, he on uh, Thursday, though, they've got a game. Washington's got a game versus the Giants. I mean, I don't know if he'll get signed between now and Thursday. I don't know, but <clears throat> if he does, it'll be crazy. He gets he gets to reunite with Ron Rivera. Uh, I don't know how this team will do. He has a great defense, like a top defense. Um, Yeah, this team, if he joins the football team, if he joins Washington, yeah, they'll be, they'll be good, I guess. But uh, maybe, I mean... You know, if it, it would be cool. It, it would be amazing. If he just turns back into 2015 fam, that would be insane. But I don't know what's going to happen. But, yeah, that's all I, that's all I got to say. I mean, Cam, uh, I mean, in conclusion, what I think, I mean, he might might be done. It might be time for him. But, I mean, he could get signed by team soon. That's what I have to say. What do you, uh, what's your conclusion for this situation? Washington's, Washington has to sign him. It's that's all I have to say. Yeah, they have to sign up. I mean, they have Heineke and Montez, but I mean, I don't know who they're gonna use. They could be using Heineke. I mean, I don't know if they don't want to use them too. They're gonna have to sign Cam. I mean, keep in mind they do have Kyle Allen. Yeah, that thing I just showed you guys that was from like a week ago, a few days after, just a few days after he got released. But yeah, that's all I gotta say. So, so what you think Washington's gotta pick him up? That's it. I that's don't all, know. That's all I got. That's all I have to say about him. Yeah, that's all we gotta say. And we're yeah we're gonna get we're gonna get back to watching some football yeah so we got yeah I'll just get hit you guys on the score I mean um okay so yeah the Patriots and Dolphins it's seventeen ten um by the time this video is out these games either could be over or whatever and the Browns are Chiefs yeah the Browns are winning by twelve they're winning twenty two ten but the Chiefs are in Brown territory the Saints are up twenty four three wow come on um, their defense is so good but I have to admit. If I if I have to admit, I am totally wrong on the Packers for this game. I thought they were gonna win, not convincingly, but I thought they were gonna win. Dude, Hogan got a touchdown, and Rodgers is, jeez, what Winston has eighty five yards. That's it. He has three touchdowns. That is just whatever. Rodgers threw two, two picks. 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 Yeah, okay, that's probably what's bad. And the Broncos are up by ten to the Giants. Yeah, some things I'm not expecting. Let's go over some upsets. Rodgers is just not. He just doesn't look right. Yeah. The, that just he doesn't. The Cardinals destroyed the Titans. Um, the Bengals won against the Vikings. The Eagles won by twenty six. Dude, they destroyed them. That's probably gonna be one of their only wins. Oh my God, the the Steelers beat the Bills. That just doesn't make that. Okay, I I like the Patriots, but I don't for some reason I just don't hate the Bills. But just I, I don't know. I just I just I'm support. I kind of support the Bills, but. I, I mean, yeah, it's, I feel kind of sad that they, it's, I feel kind of bad for the Bills that they lost that game to the Steelers. I mean, the Steelers aren't bad, but 
That's gonna end it. I mean, I just wanted to keep like and subscribe. Uh, go to subscribe to Dox's channel. Yeah, really, time, yeah. really exciting but weird start to the season, if you ask me. Yeah, I have one thing to say, Aaron Rodgers. I hate you. Yeah, I don't like Aaron Rodgers because he's on my fantasy team right now, and he's stinking it up. Either way, like subscribe and bye. Yeah, bye. Have fun watching. Have fun yeah, watching happy the NFL. It's yeah, back better. It's than back ever. better than ever.